Hello everybody, welcome back to Thieges YouTube. Pretty much what I do here is I review the most interesting notebooks to come through the gaming market, but what I have for you today is not a notebook review, it is in fact yet another Battlefield 3 PC performance analysis video, this time featuring the Lenovo IdeaPad Y560 notebook. The reason I'm using this notebook this time is because I know that there are a lot of you out there with comparable casual gaming rigs or notebooks that would like to know just how Battlefield 3 will look on your PC, and well, this is how. The Lenovo IdeaPad Y560 uses the Intel Core i7-720QM processor and the Radeon 5730 graphics card with 1 gig of DDR3 VRAM. This card is roughly the equivalent to the HD4670, HD6570, or the 8800GS and GT240 desktop graphics cards. The reason why I'm making this little feature is so that you can look at the FPS, compare your specs to the ones in the video, and know for sure if you can keep your system the way it is, or maybe want to upgrade. I'll be using two different graphics settings for this video, the first being the settings that were determined automatically, except here I've cut out the motion blur completely, the texture settings are set to high, and everything else is pretty much on medium with 4x anisotropic filtering. Let's get into the gameplay. Right away we see that our frame rates are just below 30 FPS. I have to have just a smidge of patience when placing my shots to ensure their accuracy, even though there isn't any input lag. Thanks to the super enhanced anti-aliasing, the picture is still very smooth, despite the 720p resolution. In multiplayer, you're going to be at a small disadvantage to other gamers using more powerful rigs, and another huge bottleneck about this machine is that it's using a 5400 RPM hard drive, and that did contribute some stuttering, which was very noticeable, although the game is still very playable. Let's go ahead and reduce the graphics settings a bit, see if we can make it go a little bit smoother. Okay, what I've done here is kill off pretty much everything, reducing the texture quality to medium and everything else to low, and taking off that really cool anti-aliasing effect as well. The resolution is going to stay at 720p anyway, because going any lower is just going to look awful, and no gamer should have to go any lower than 1366 by 768 So here our sub-30 FPS has changed to going a bit above 30, this game still looks very beautiful, even at its lowest possible detail setting, but you really can't tell the difference without the anti-aliasing. Honestly, there's not too much of a difference in the frame rate, and Battlefield 3 is really punishing the Lenovo here. That being said, the game is still playable, and the graphics don't scale back a lot between medium and low detail settings. Okay, so to conclude, what I'd say is that if you want to have good frame rates and high detail settings, get a notebook with an NVIDIA GTX 480M or better, or a Radeon 6990M. For desktop users, if you want competitive frame rates in high details, use the GTX 560 Ti or better, or the Radeon 6950 or better. Well, there you have it. I hope you enjoyed the video. Go ahead and check out my review of the Lenovo IdeaPad Y560 on my channel, featuring the very beautiful Alice, and my latest single, Watching Her Dance. Thanks for watching, and you guys have a good night.